that's my that's my butt. It's not my actual butt, but it's my butt. Yeah, yeah whatever. It's rubbing on the chair. Uh. There was no need for that. <laughs> what do you do, baby boo? Pit check. Nope, I didn't shave him. Mind your business. Oh, and hello, welcome back to Time with Tally, or welcome to Time with Tally. If you've never known my channel before, I am so excited to have you, and I hope that you like what you see. Today, I am going to be doing a video that was requested on my Instagram, and actually, it's been requested for quite a while. <laughs> I've just been a little bit delayed on making it because I'm also a little scared. As you all know, I do a little bit of lifestyle, fitness, and beauty content, but I'm trying to get up my beauty content. I haven't really done full glam looks in quite a while. I used to be really into makeup, but the gym life, you know, it, it, it kind of took over. For today's video, I'm going to do a full glam look. Today, I got some inspiration from a dress that I have that I have never worn. These are the colors that are in the dress. It's like a two piece, whatever. But you see, it has those like really pretty, like orangey pinks going on, red. We'll try it out. I'm going to do my best to somewhat face the camera. I do have a very large mirror. Yeah, so this mirror actually takes up all my space, so I can't really put my camera in front of it. So I usually kind of have to put you guys on the side of me. I'm not a beauty guru. All right, so I'm starting off with my moisturizer, and then we're going to get some primer on. I'm not going to lie to you, I'm very nervous because I don't want it to be bad and I feel like I'm definitely a little rusty and I wasn't even a pro before or anything I just really liked it so I did decent this is my primer stick it in okay I gotta grow up now don't be me and don't use a bunch of makeup that's likely expired because like I said I haven't used it in a very long time this could be really bad for your skin if you have sensitive skin. So don't do what I do. So I have this Fenty Beauty Eye Primer. So that's the one I'm gonna use. I'm just gonna pat this one in with my finger. I tend to use my finger for a lot of things. So don't be surprised. Wash your hands. I usually do my eyes first, or that's what I used to do. I'm very much in the 2016 era of makeup still. Don't come at me. I'm gonna start with some tape. In order for me to start with my eyes first, I usually will do my eyebrows first because I'm very particular about them. Also, I will usually conceal around them. So the last thing I need is doing an eye look and then doing my eyebrows afterwards because they can mess with each other. I actually just usually will like brush up in the middle part right here just to kind of diffuse that color and it doesn't look as blocky. So let me go to the other eye and then I will come back. Alrighty then, so I believe that this is as good as it's gonna get. I always say eyebrows are sisters, not twins. Bye. Especially because I have like one eye, like the, my this one, my eyebrow is higher than this one. I think it's because I always do that. Let's get started on the eye look. I am so nervous. I have a bunch of colors in front of me I'm gonna show you. Here I have an array of brushes. Some of which have been deceased, RIP. <laughs> Some don't even have the head on anymore. That's how long it's been. Like what, like what is this? This one hasn't even been used. I think we're gonna go with this one to start and I'm gonna start out with like a little skin tone slash peachy shade just to cover my whole eyelid. I like to set a base. I feel like my eyelids already give me a hard time blending as it is. I don't know what it is about my eyelids, especially on this eye. This eye, I have like this like weird little patch right in the middle of my eye somewhere that it literally just won't hold product. The rest of my eye will be blended beautiful and it's literally just one random patch. I have cleaned it, I have scrubbed it, literally don't know what the hell's wrong with it. I also have smaller eyelids, I feel like. I don't feel like my eyelids are really that spacious enough for like really nice colors and big, you know, things, but. Way 
where you hold the brush matters because the closer that you hold it, the more pressure is applied and it's probably not doing exactly what you would like. A lot of the times you have to be very light. I'm not really a pink girl, which is really funny. I don't feel like it looks good on me, but we're gonna try. Okay. I'm very scared for what's about to happen. I'm so scared. Trust the process. <laughs> I'm so scared. I'm gonna look so crazy after this. Today's a snow day in my city, so I'm actually even gonna put on some lashes for y'all. I feel like I look like a circus clown. Absolutely insanity. Oh my god. Oh my god. Um. I'm not really a fan as of right now. It looks like absolute dog shit right now. And I keep on telling myself to trust the process. Don't know if I should trust mine. <laughs> and I'm just going to pat the colors on, blend them as much as possible, and we're gonna go from there and just pray. I'm sure once I have lashes and or eyeliner and other things on, I'm gonna be fine, but right now it's pretty bad. <laughs> I'm gonna take like a skin tone slash white-ish shade. Put them up here. Right now my my eyes look like the color wheel and not in a good way. I'm just gonna keep on blending and hoping that these harsh lines go away. Okay. Okay, believe it or not, that's actually looking a lot better. I'm just gonna add in some colors where I feel like it's necessary. Okay, so I feel like this is as good as it's gonna get. For some reason, my left eye never comes out as good as my right. I think I might just give myself like a liner or a smoky liner. I have no idea, to be completely honest with you. Truthfully, this didn't go how I expected in my head. I'm not fully mad at that. It is what it is. I'm not gonna lie, I'm kind of giving up, so. Who knows if I'll even post this? <laughs> um, this is the one thing I did hate a lot about doing my eyes first. It never felt as if I could see the full picture until I actually finished. Worst case scenario, I hate it, and I just start over and do something else. It looks like it has too much orange and pink and shit, and then this one has too much yellow. What in the fuck is going on? Okay, so now that I've given up, because <laughs> I really have, yeah, I don't feel like makeup is my thing anymore, but I went for a very complicated look for no reason. I could have literally just done a simple eye, but it's how I wanted to be extra. I know you wanna try, give me that space. that kind of brought it together a little bit. Let's bounce. I haven't done my makeup in literally like so long. I'm feeling a little bit emotional right now. That came out of nowhere, anyways. <laughs> Wow, this is pretty nostalgic for me right now. Having all my makeup in front of me and literally touching brushes I feel like I haven't touched in so long. For my nose, I go in with like a smaller brush too. Hello? Here. Hi. Lie to me. It's okay. You can tell me it's bad. <laughs> I don't think it's bad. <laughs> uh, <yeah. laughs> it's terrible. I know. Listen, I'm getting in practice. Okay. Everyone say hi to Jonathan. <laughs>
gonna say I just need time right now I'm going alone tonight I don't need nobody else but me All right, so I look a little crazy right now, but I'm gonna go in with some pearl gems. I have no idea what I wanna do yet. We'll figure it out as we go along. Wish me luck. Okay, are you guys ready? Cause I'm ready. Ah, I'm so happy. For someone that hasn't touched makeup in so, so long, I, I don't even understand how I was able to <laughs> get here. If you guys wanna see more beauty looks, just let me know. <laughs> I was a little bit nervous about the colors with my hair, but I think, yeah, I think it goes together beautifully. I'm so happy with the result. I will see you guys in the next one. Thank you so much for spending time with me. I love you all. I appreciate your support. And I'm just so happy to have you here. Bye!